Hello. These are my drawings from um, second semester of school for drawing two. For this one we had to use mixed media gesso. Camera's upside down. <laughs> And this one we had to capture color inside of a shadow. The drawing two are now allowed to use color, so most of these are gonna be in color. And this one we're supposed to use optical blending. And these all kind of mushed into the same color. <laughs> supposed to be three different objects of three different color, but kind of failed. <laughs> This is a redo of another one. Hopefully it's right behind this one. Yeah. Another optical mixing. It's supposed to look like real skin from far away. And it was a redo of this one. Because this one kind of looks like goblin hands. Too much colors. This is a collage, mixed media collage, done with oil pastels, uh, color aid paper, and acrylic paint. This is an in-class drawing. We had to use continuous contour, and we had to draw the things behind the model too, to show depth. And this was an extra one I did. I'm trying to remember. Oh yeah. We had to use gesso with the soft pastels. And I wanted to do two because I had the time. <laughs> and there's the first one I did. So the cotton balls is just white gesso. And everything else is soft pastel. These are in class studies. Gestures. <laughs> and we had to capture depth again with this one. So it's my mom in the laundry room in the basement. <laughs> and this one was interesting. We had to study the model for five minutes straight and then draw her from memory. And this one was from my imagination. Just a mermaid washing her hair. <laughs> I don't know why a mermaid would need to wash her hair though, because she's always in water. But it's kind of cool looking, I guess. And this is a model in class drawing. And this is another depth study done outside my window. And the last one of the portfolio was losing form and shadow. That's my cat. <laughs> um, yeah, I just added little tiny people here to make it kind of look like this is like a party area, I guess. And then added little lights. I don't know if the camera can catch it. And there's a moon up there. And let's see. I'm not going to show all the drawings inside these pads over here. Because there's way too many. But this one was supposed to represent anger. The figure. You can't really tell. <laughs> This one is anger and anxiety. And this is another depth study done outside the window from the college. And that's all I have to show. Thanks for watching. God bless.